people waiting will be taking questions now. Get comfy. Get comfy. Hello everybody and welcome to That's Football. It's episode 51 of our Manchester United career mode and we're going straight into it. I don't like doing this, but we're going straight into the top of the table clash with Manchester City. It's just how it's fallen and um, I do worry about playing the first game <coughs> as a big game because you could go into it a little bit, uh, I nearly said a little bit stiff. Well, we are excited, but I don't mean like that. I mean like, you know, not playing loosely, um, playing a little bit uh, within ourselves. So we'll see how it goes. Um, but big game against City. Most important thing is not to lose, but obviously we want to win. You put the game beyond doubt. Uh, it's revenge as well. It's revenge as well. Revenge as well. Uh, hey, Mark, what did you have for your lunch, says Jake Kerr? Packet of crisps and a, and a blueberry smoothie. Honest answer for an honest question. Don't be cold. Today, no, That's let's go into it stiff. Um, warm and loose and ready. We need a bit... Oh, I'm going to get away from that. But uh, look, that's the league table at the moment. We're playing Manchester City. It's November the 5th in the league season. And um, I didn't do a warm-up game. No, Abdullah, was, I, I was intending to do a warm-up game. But then I was doing a bit... Of, I was doing some other stuff. And I didn't. So um, it's a must-win game, says uh, Connor. And uh, right... Let's have a look at this league table. So, yeah, Man City are three points ahead of us. They've won 11 games in a row. This is FIFA. Welcome to FIFA career mode for you. Could be really enjoyable, but whoever does the bloody um, data on FIFA 20 career mode, they must they must just let anybody do it. Hi, Mark. Please say happy birthday to my girlfriend, Selena, in your funny, sarcastic voice, says Nathan Medhurst. I don't know about funny, sarcastic, but happy birthday, Selena. We're really, really all happy to be here saying happy birthday to you when really we want to get on with the Manchester derby. Sarcastic enough? Um, anyway, I hope you do have a good birthday. And I've had a shave. Yes, James, I have. I've, I've had a shave. But for those who've been on the career mode journey, you will know that Manchester City was 6-1 up against in our, in our destiny game, the Champions League final. It feels not long ago. They were 6-1 up at half-time. We were absolutely done over. And today, today we're trying to get a bit of revenge. Uh, we've got to take a look at our team there, actually. And I very nearly said, let's start. Let's not start, because that's not the centre-back pairing that I want to see. I want to see uh, Varane playing, of course. And uh, I'm quite happy with that team. Hey, Mark, just caught up the last few days. I don't want to see any more simming. Otherwise, as an ex-Ilkiston lad, I'll come and sort you out, says Peter Jones. Not an Ilkiston lad. Ilkeston Co-op Travel's gonna get you there. You'll know what that is if you're a proper Ilkeston lad. Right. Let's do this. Why did I get up early this morning, says Nick Walker. Well, if I told you that, you'd know more than me. You're at home. We are, so we're, we're three points behind them. And now... Uh, they smashed us in the Champions League final. My obsession this season is that. Thoughts on the First Minister extending lockdown, says Jake Kerr. Who's the First Minister? Is she the Scottish one? I don't know. Check their team, says the Reds. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do that. But this is our massive game. Absolutely massive. And uh, we're really up for it, as you can tell. And uh, I'm a little bit nervous because I think if you lose this game, you give them a six-point lead at the start of the season uh, in November, it gives them something. Van der Beek, De Bruyne, Rodri, Osman, Mares, Sterling, Zinchenko, Carrera, Laporte, Cancelo and Edison. I don't know who Carrera is because um, in my time there, they've had Koulibaly and Maguire, which they've sold both. Play on Ultiman, says Wizam. Oh, yeah, I really want to be depressed. The 6-2 the six two is still holding to you. Will you be able to get over it in the near future, says Cavalier Cray Masters? Well, there's nothing near. There's no there's no future nearer than this. We're off. <sighs> Come on. Let's do it. <laughs> they had a good game plan against us in the Champions League final, but the game did really... Oh, what are we doing? Bruno, don't be making mistakes like that. Feel your way in. Oh, for God's sake. Mbappe. 
He's past him. Bruno. Pogba. Good play this. Terrible cross. Terrible cross. And a, a little bit of a nervy start from me, I think, to be honest. Just need to settle in. This is the problem with the first game, isn't it? Terrible, Bruno. You're trying to score a worldie. Calm down. Calm down. TW Tyler's singing in his bedroom for me. As long as you're not singing y YNCA or something like that. Uh, you know, a little bit of Rick Astley, bit of Oasis. That sounds good. I can picture you there in your uh, your big coat and a big pair of sunglasses trying to be Liam. That's easy, wan -Bissakers. Little dink, yes. I'm liking this. Oh, brute Martial. That was such an easy pass. So what you're passing out. Let him shoot from there. Let him shoot from there all day. Every day. Steady start. He wants it. There should be nobody quicker in the game. Oh, what have you? are having a laugh. He's giving them the foul as well. Bold. Uh, Bundesliga starts on the 16th of May, says Mr. Beast. Yes, yes. Um, unless it gets called off, we pretty much know we'll be doing a watch-along next Saturday afternoon. Oh, what's Bruno doing? He's having a bloody nightmare. Schalke against Dortmund. Bloody hell, come on. Yeah, we'll do the watch along for that next week. Definitely. Looking forward to it. Sancho watch as well. That's a good ball. Oh, Pogba! Couldn't get it out of his feet. Best chance of the game so far. Martial actually sorting his passing out. Could I have gone a little bit closer? I could. He'd already made the slide tackle. I could have gone so much closer. Oh, closer than that. Touch me. Ref, he's giving it. He's giving the penalty, ref. He's given a penalty. I don't. I, I don't even know if it was a penalty, but it's a penalty. And I, I, I felt like Carrera did something, and I don't know what he did. Yeah, <laughs> he stomped, stamped on him. What are you on about, Pep? He stamped on him. He should be given a red. Yeah, the spitting image of Sir Alex Ferguson with the gums is killing. This is Sir. This is Sir Alex. Right, you're not taking it. Martial on this. Get in! Get in! Anthony Martial! There we go. He's there. He's up pointing to the sky. And it is a penalty. Every time I watch it, you get a penalty, says Paul. I don't. It was a clear penalty, says Nitish. And it's a lovely penalty by Martial. Sent in the wrong way. He wasn't going to save that anyway. And Mark will miss, says Sean Hunter. How stupid do you look? Definite penalty, and it's 1-0. Come on! I don't think this is going to be a classic, but I do think it's going to be about grinding. Which is something that we need to do. What a tackle. You've took him out. He ain't catching you. Go on, Sancho. You've took them all out. It's all open here. He's got to find a pass. Oh, what a miss. What a bloody miss. What an opportunity that was. Got it all wrong. Oh, 
That's good defending. Just calm. Calmness personified. He wants it. He's got so much space, Killian Mbappe. Kill him off, Killian. Kill him off, Killian. Yes! 2 0. Come on! Breathing space. They got caught out. Their right back came forward. He got robbed in the penalty box. And United couldn't believe their luck because Mbappe was free on the halfway line. And as he ran free, no one was going to catch him. Born free. And there he is. Lovely finish. Mbappe 2 0. Ain't getting near that, Edison. Goldbridge comes into the game cold, but he's not cold anymore. He's hot, hot, hot. 2-0, Man City. They, where are you now? Where's your 6-1 glitch now, bitch? Where's your Champions League final now, huh? Huh? I must admit, I did. I was 2-0 up against Liverpool last season at this point and lost 3-2. But the thing about Man City is when they're, when they're behind, they've got a... Oh, he's away again. Where's their defence? Corner. Still don't. I still don't believe this is this game is anywhere near over. They've not. Remember, Man City have not lost a game all season. They've won every single game. They are the Champions League holders. They are the Premier League holders. That was close. And again, it's the out ball. Ref is not given a thing. That's late. You're going to get booked for that pog, but they don't like it up them though. Don't concede before half time. Goal kick. Yes. Cascade says you're so sloppy in defence, yet I'm winning 2-0. Cooking with Goldbridge is back tomorrow. It's revenge time, says Salish. The whole season's going to be revenge, Salish. My Champions League obsession. But this, this would be a massive result if we can do it. It's payback time. Copite says, I only like watching it when you lose. Oh, well, mate, there'll, there'll be plenty of those to come. Don't worry. Um, we're not bothered. We're not bothered about half times at the moment because we're masters of our own destiny. Pogba's looking tired. Mr. B says, who's going to win the Bundesliga title? Bayern Munich will win it. They're four points clear. Dortmund have got an outside chance. Leipzig have got a chance because they've got the easier games. But they're still five points off the top. They Leipzig need Dortmund to beat Bayern and then drop points as well. But, you know, I, I expect Bayern Munich to win it. I've made a mistake here. I've made a proper mistake. Oh, God, I thought he'd scored then. He thought he'd scored as well. Sloppy there. That ball to Mbappe is on every time. Well, it wasn't on there. Oh, look at their passing. Look at Pep's passing. Tenali, he's run the midfield so well all game. Cross it. What was that? That was a bit dodgy. That should have been an easy pass across the ground. Pogba wins it. Martial. Lay it off. Pogba. Little dink. Sancho went for something a bit silly there. McTominay comes on for Pogba, yes. Bundesliga is normally on BT. In the UK.
Mbappe with the worst cross I think you'll ever see in football, yeah. On FIFA. Oh, watch out. Sterling forever in Juan Basaka's pocket. Oh, Sancho. These games are difficult because you've got a, you've got a, you've got three points are in the bag at half time. And you've just got to not let them score, not let them back into the game. <clears throat> Defend solid. Do I think English football will be back any time soon? No. I don't. Ge genuinely, I don't. Go on. Martial. Sixty-three minutes. <laughs> Fill in, Scott. Yeah, you've read that. You've read that. Oh, whatever. Why would Scott McTominay pass it to a City player? Here we go again. Glitch, bitch. <sighs> oh, that was in as well. There, it's over the bar. Donnarumma's got that covered. Discipline, Mark, says Vico. All about the discipline. He's offside. Dan James o'clock. Yeah, it is Dan James o'clock. Martial's tired. Might have swap Mbappe with Sancho, actually. Sancho. Where's Dan James? I haven't even got him. He's not on the bloody bench. What a prat. What 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 a prat. Like literally what a prat. That would have been Imagine if it was nil nil and he needed Dan James. That is a right big mistake. I've just not put him on the bench. That is... How did nobody notice that before the game started? It's your fault as much as it's mine. We've not played well second half at all. Still Mbappe. He's shown some skills today. Corner. Not Scrinia. Go on, Scotty. Keep battling. God, this has been a really bad second half. Really bad. Go on, Sterling. I dare you to run it, wan I dare you to do it. You don't dare do it. Don't concede. Oh, what a tackle. Varan. Right. That's a lovely ball. That's a lovely goal. Rashford to Martial. 3-0. Icing on the cake. You've got to applaud Scott McTominay for his ball to Rashford there. Because he could have gone obviously to Mbappe. He didn't. The ball goes through to Rashford. A lovely ball by Rashford. And it's just on the head of Martial. Which is ideal really. Because you don't want it to be on the knob or the chest. It's on the head. Here it comes. You're going to see it back. Lovely little ball. Perfectly flighted, up and over. Keeper can't do anything about it. 3-0. Lovely little header by Martial as well. Gets up. That's unstoppable. Keeper says that's unstoppable. 3-0. And, and, and we've turned we've turned their goal difference a little bit as well. Because they were about 10 ahead. Now that'll come down to about three. Three off them, three onto us. That's a swing of six.
Well, that, how does it feel, Man City? I mean, it still doesn't take away... This is not revenge for the Champions League. Revenge for the Champions League will come with a trophy. And maybe we will see them. In fact, I'm sure we will see Man City in a final soon. This is the best I've seen your places, Nick P. Thanks, Nick. Oh, that was probably a little bit tired there. We won't be top of the league, but we'll be joint top of the league. The most important thing is after this game is to go and win the next game. Don't go and do what Mourinho's or Van Hal's or even Ollie's teams have done in the past. Win the big game and then not win the next one. It's the first game of the stream, everybody, as well. I'm very proud because I don't think I've played that well. I think I've played a typical first game stream. Varane's been brilliant. Would have gone in. Mark says you're going to lose it against the weakened team. Sterling now. Go on, dare you. Turns back every time. Every time Wan Bissaka comes near Sterling, he turns away and goes home. I'm going home. I don't fancy it. I'm terrified. Oh, and they can't score. It's another save by Danaruma. Who would have predicted this? 3-0. Pep in the mud. Catch it. Catch it. How how about we finish the Premier League in Germany and after they successfully carry out the Bundesliga better than Australia, I think. <laughs> Says uh, Uktosh. And uh, we're going to win the league now. You're going to believe us. Says Kian Carroll. And the ref blows it up. Unbeaten at home, says Mr. Beast. Why did I tell you all? What did I say to you all? I said after that Champions League final, we will get back on that horse. We will come. Uh, my jersey hasn't come yet, VNO. Um, you've got to account for a little bit of delay because of the virus, haven't you? 3-0 um, win on the first game. Player ratings. Martial with a 9.3. Mbappe, 8.5. Uh, defensively, Varane was absolutely brilliant. They've got that right. 8.1 for him. Brilliant performance from him. And a lovely, lovely win. Liverpool winning against Leicester as well. Keeps Liverpool only three points behind. Only three points behind us. Liverpool and City, as you would expect. Liverpool and City running away with it. I hope we haven't got Burnley next, Ronald. I love your videos, Mark. They keep my day... Uh, Keep, make my day. Keep safe, says Dylan Roberts. Thank you. Is it Dylan? Dylan Roberts. Martial, two goals. We can go all the way. I get asked that every question. Well done to the lads. 7-6 on aggregate. Yes, you're right. 6-4, 7-6. We've got to put... Uh, Dan James into this team. These mistakes cannot happen again. Where are you, DJ? There we go. Get your best team out. Robert Taylor says, stop chewing. So you, you only have to ask, but take it out. I'm not bothered. I'm not Sir Alex. He'll never take his gum out. Okay. We've got Everton next. Oh, I tell you what, that could be a toughie. That could be a toughie. So there's the league table. We're joint top after 12 games, 33 points. That's good. I'm happy with that. And the interesting thing is, we lost the opening game of the season to Newcastle. But look, Newcastle aren't that bad. They're sixth. You know, they're not terrible. People said, people laughed when I lost to Newcastle. Um, and they're not bad. They're in sixth place. I mean, Watford are in fifth. That's a bit of a joke. It's taken the piss a little bit there. Goal difference I'll have a look at in a minute. And Everton coming up. Okay, let's have a look at the goal difference because we can have a look where Everton are in the league. Ooh, got a bad back. Ooh. 
Anyone else, anyone else really hate gum? Says Cave. He's got it in for gum. Not gun, gum. Uh, so goal difference for us is uh, 22 and theirs is 27. So that could be key. You're right. You can't, you're right. Man City will just whack everybody. Everton not having a great season, but Goodison Park, it's always one of my favourite games of the season, Everton. And um, we'll probably make a couple of changes for this. Just because I like to freshen things up. You know me. Always clean. Keep it clean. Bit of, uh, bit of links under your arms and a... Wash your hands and clean your toes. Give Luke Shaw a game. And... What else could we do? Might give Fred a game in the midfield. Yeah, that'll do. Just a couple of changes. Just just to keep it, keep it, comp keep it competent. You're playing well because you've got good morale. Arsenal are in 13th. Sim. We don't sim. Rebecca's right. We don't sim. Rate your signings so far, says Phantom Gaming. I think Tonali, who I bought the season before this one, is probably the best signing. Um, he's been brilliant. Uh, Alfonso Davis has been... I think all the signings this summer have been good. Varane's been brilliant. Mbappe's been brilliant. Davies has been brilliant. But you'd expect that. You know, they were... They were icing on the cake, players. But what I'm proud about in Season 4 is I've still got so many... And Donnarumma's done very well as well. I've still got so many players that are actually part of the team. Um, you know, Bruno, Pogba, wan Martial. Considering it's Season 4, Fred... Although I did sell Fred and buy him back. Go on, attack it, Luke. Attack it. Into Martial. Oh, dear. Hank says that goal difference doesn't work. It's actually goal, It's actually done on alphabetical. On FIFA. I don't know. Luke Shaw's in trouble here. Look, give him some help. Good. Oh, he's found him. This is 1 0. This is easy. 1 0. This is 1 0, I'm telling you. <laughs> Don't let Mbappe go. I told you that he's, he's, the, he's the pumped up, pimped up Rashford. He's like Rashford for me on season one. He, he just, you get, they've made a right mistake there, Everton. Lovely ball by Bruno to get him away. But I know I'm scoring from here. I'm cutting in. They've not got the pace. And then he's going to bang it in the bottom corner. Lovely goal. 1-0. Check Everton's team. Everton are always tough at Goodison. Keep Moise Keane, Tussan, Davies, Delph, Gomez, Gordon, Balassi at left back. Carlson. Carlson's my player. Carlson's my loney. Tompkins, Tavernier, Cadosa. Yeah, time's not been kind, has it? Greenwood's on the bench, Keen Carroll. So their centre-back, Carlson, who looks like Zlatan there in the top left, he's actually on loan there from me. This is, to be honest, looking at that Everton team, time's not been kind on Everton. Referee. That's filthy. Go. Oh, oh Martial. You know, I keep looking in the live comments to see if we're going to see Jake again and he, you know, about his dog. I never saw his. I never saw him comment again. I hope he took it in good faith. I hope he took it for the nice niceness it was. That is brilliant. That is superb. Oh, what? Did, why didn't Martial hit that? Do you see the play between Pogba and Martial there, and then he didn't shoot. In fact, I'm going to play this back. It's hilarious. It's absolutely hilarious. Watch. Watch this. Hide that. I don't know why it doesn't look. There you go. One. Two, he's away. Am I ready to shoot? And he runs past the bloody ball. That's FIFA for you, isn't it? Crazy. No excuse for it.
Everton are trash here. This could this could be this could be a big score if we get it. Recall Carlison. Well, we'll see how good he is. Well, that was rubbish. Rubbish holding up of Mbappe and he gets his shot off. It's all a bit scrap. Ooh, what? I'm Basaka getting caught underneath it a little bit there. Oh. Trying to be a bit clever with the skills there. Morale of this team is so good. You can tell the morale is good. Everything's really working well. Passing. Speed. Martial, too wide. Oh, good shot, though. Hey, Joao, Joao has just said, come out with probably the... set. This, this is the sentence of 2020, he says. Wait for it. Tw se sentence of 2020. Mark Goldbridge is the sexiest man alive. <sighs> Tell you what, that guy who's put that, they know their thing. I'm only joking. Watch out. Good save. When you score with Mbappe, press X. Isabella's telling me off for not concentrating. It's a nice... Oh, come on, hold the ball up. Easy. No kick. Go, 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 go. Go, run. Oh. I think on another day we could be blasting these about 4-0. To go, Alex. Poor defensively, that is. How do you not? How do you can keep a clean sheet against City and can see the crap goal like that? Everybody's back in place there. Carlson, don't you celebrate your traitor? What 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 goes wrong here? Oh, it's just terrible defensively. Concentrate. Isabella was right. Bloody hell. Everton have got. Look at Everton now. All the confidence they've got. That's the ball. Come on. Let's get moving. That's a lovely ball. Go. I tell you what, if that if that's what you're all about, Carlson, you're not coming back to Old Trafford because that was crap defending from you. Sancho just blitzed past him for pace. Look at Carlson; he's got himself all wrong, running like he's shit himself. See Carlson there with his little legs. Oh, oh, I've shit myself. Easy, too easy to get past him. Not not uh, not a good defender there. Dylan Roberts says, "I'm a windmill, everybody. I'm a windmill." That's a classic. I should have pressed X, damn. Incompetent defence. Everton in the mud. A lot of people wanting me to lose there today. Oh, that Bruno. Don't actually think Bruno's been playing that well lately, you know. Yes, Fred. Yes. 
and he's offside. Missed anyway. That's one of them one where you want to play the pass but you can't play it quick enough. Cooley Barley to Liverpool, what are my thoughts on that? Absolutely none. No chance, to be honest. Sanjay says, I love your front three. Quick on the break. Oh, here we go. Here we go. He's looking. Easiest goal Anthony Martial's going to score. Just waiting for it to land. He's offside. Shit. How was he offside for that? I don't think... You know, he could be a model, that linesman. Right, shoots. Oh, come on. He's bloody miles offside. He couldn't even... He couldn't be more offside if he tried. You see that? Of course you did. Thomas Rose has just got me all excited. He said that City are drawing at Bournemouth. Have they got a bit of a hangover? They won't lose to Bournemouth. They won't draw at Bournemouth. They'll win there. Lovely tackle. Alfie, Alfie Barker says, It's my birthday on the 28th. Will you be alive? Live, he means. 28th is quite far away. Oh, shit. Oh, tell you what, this game fancies Everton a bit. Look at Carlson. He's got nothing. He's off. He's going to get a red. <laughs> he's going to get a red. He's on loan and he's going to get a red. Well, that's embarrassing. All the Carlson lovers in the live comments who are saying bring him back. He's had a bloody nightmare here. He's had an absolute nightmare. Look at him pulling him off. Straight red Carlson. Embarrassing. Embarrassing for the lad. Oh, we've not had one of these in a while. He's, look at their goalkeeper. It's Frodo Baggins. He's bloody tiny. If he saves this, I'm an idiot. <laughs> bloody Frodo Baggins in goal. He's tiny. The Hobbit. You ain't getting near that. All I had to do is put a bit of height on it. 3-1. Look. Look at him. He may, it may as well be my little Seb in goal. And he's only two and a half. Look at that goalkeeper. He's bloody... He's, he's, he's a right laugh. He's like that bloody goalkeeper who used to play for Mexico. Campo. He's tiny. Anyway, Agent Carlson's done his job. Bruno scores a hat. I tell you what, if you're only just tuning in, me and free kicks on FIFA. I'm better at free kicks than penalties. I don't even get excited about those sort of free kicks anymore because I'm just so good at them. I'm not arrogant. Subs. It's subs o'clock. Let's look. Goal difference. Yes. You're exactly right. Bloody goal difference, everybody. Let's go for goals. I've not. I tell you what. I've not. I've never seen that before. I've never seen uh, in four seasons. I've not seen a ball over the top and a red card before. You should have scored that, Bruno. Got to at least get 4-1 in this. Oh, come on. Fred's been brilliant today.
Good tackle, Pogba. Oh, come on, ref. It was a fair tackle, that. Manx Power says no eats Willy. That's rude, uh, but funny. Mark, do you think Bale will come to Man United? No. Ah, you see? That's what happens when you don't put a Hobbit in goal. They can dive and save it. Goal. Mar oh, Dan James. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> no pissing about one-on-one -on -one there from Dan James. No little finesse shot. Just blast the back of it as hard as you can. And Everton... 4-1 down here. This is exactly the result we wanted after the the win against Man City. Down to 10 men Everton. Slide rule pass. And it's just gonna he's just gonna blast this. Bang. 4-1. Give Green Greenwood some time. Good idea. Give give Greenwood some time. He's 85 rated. I mean I just uh, I don't know what it is about Greenwood, but there just seems to he doesn't seem to play like an 85 rated striker. <laughs> yeah, if I'd have read that out, it would have been really good. But uh, you don't, you've got to get up early to catch me out. I just went uh, to put on my cauliflower, and you're four 0 up, says Nick P. Sancho wants a goal. And so does Greenwood. There it is. It's five. Reunite reports that United have agreed to sign 16-year-old fullback Mark Gerardo from Barcelona when his contract expires in June. Says Eric Menendez. Little bit of uh, little bit of uh, uh, reality there. Um, change the difficulty. Oh, piss off. Change the bloody difficulty. Yeah. Piss off. No way. I'm not changing the difficulty. Just because I started to win games, I've got to change the difficulty because you want to see me lose. Two streams ago, I got battered 6-1 on this level of difficulty by Man City. And now because I'm fighting for a title, everyone's like, oh, change the difficulty. We love it when you nearly kill yourself with high blood pressure and a heart attack. Put the difficulty up so you get really angry. No, I'm not. This is only because we're on a good run at the moment. I'll guarantee you, I've played plenty of FIFA through my life. There's no way we're going to play like this for the rest of the season. And I'm not putting it on ultimate difficulty. So you can kiss me ass. I told you my obsession was to win the Champions League. That's what it was. We are playing 10 men as well. Bruno wants... Here we go. Oh, damn. That was a crap cross. We want six. We can close the goal difference down here. Oh, Jaden Sancho, 6 1. Lovely goal. Everton are just all at sea. Pack of dolphins at the back. They've got they've got no players. They can't. They, it's just it's just finding the space. Sancho makes it six. Arsenal are losing 4-0 to Watford. It's a, it's a lovely day. My main concern this season is that we'll have one of these stupid home games against someone like Burnley and uh, we'll drop points. Do a chart show based on your career mode. It's too easy because they're down to 10 men. I wish... I, I, you know what? You lot remind me of the people who moan on the United Stand channel when we do a video on Sancho, you know, might be coming or might not be coming. And they go, oh, it's just this... You're just making it up, even though you're saying the story today on Sancho is coming from Bleacher Report or it's coming from Build. Or it's coming from Fabrizio Romano. No, no, no. You're just making it up. What a goal. What a goal. You see, this is not. This is nothing to do with easy. 
This is to do with absolutely brilliant. Every goal has been brilliant. Good for goal difference, Mark, says Card Tricker Jeffrey 12 Anyway, if you're bored, give me some questions to answer about cat food or something. Bloody hell, they're on something, them United fans. You see how quick their arms were going? They're bloody... They've, had, they've all had something. Lovely goal, this, though. Sancho, James... Did you see a P hey, did you see a Piers Morgan's tweet this morning about chocolate bars? And he said that um, his favourite is Dark Bounty, the red one. Dark Chocolate Bounty. Uh, uh, genuinely, p cat piss sounds more appealing. That's that's typical P Piers Morgan, that is, because dark chocolate's very bitter. 7-1. Is this our biggest score in the... Is this our biggest score? Could could be. Could be eight. Could be eight. Hi there at eight. Hi there at eight. Oh, I couldn't find the pass. It's going to be seven. How many variety of potatoes can you name? Says uh, Murray. Um, potatoes. King Edward. White potatoes. Um, Maryland potatoes. Or they might be cookies. DT, he's a potato. Um, I love a good whisper gold, says Freddie. St I love whisper gold. I bloody love a whisper gold, I do. Dark chocolate is for people with class. Well, why is Piers Morgan drinking it, eating it? Favourite cake? I do like a good Victoria sponge. 7-1. 7-1. Bruno with a 9.5. Sancho with a 9.5. Martial, uh, sorry, Mbappe with a 9.3. Comfortable. Man City beat Burnley 2-1. Look, you see, they're not going to give up. They're not going to give up, are they? But look at that top score. Arsenal nil, Watford 4. Mark, don't listen to the chat and put it on ultimate difficulty. Every player is insanely fast, can barely get an inch on them, says AD. I might do next season on it. I'm not trying to be mean, but come on, 7-1, says Key and Carroll. And uh, would you rather fight eight lint bunnies or 876 men, says Mingram. Let's be honest, that Everton team was crap and they were down to 10 men for half the game. Great performance, Mark. Your streams have kept me sane halfway around the world in Australia during lockdown. Keep up the great work, mate. To think City took half match to get that score, says Ishan Pundi. Yeah, thanks for that. Appreciate appreciate that. It's always nice to get it uh, kick in the nuts. Make sure you subscribe if you're new, bottom right-hand corner. And remember, a week on Saturday, we'll be back doing watch-alongs. We'll be doing Schalke and uh, Dortmund. Uh, can't believe football's coming back. Do you like Krispy Kreme donuts, says Mike? Hill. Yes, I do. I like them. There's some good cracking flavours as well. Um, right. We surely sim Rangers at home. They've got no points. We surely sim the Rangers game at home. C come on. Surely we do. I know people say don't sim, but I'm thinking we surely do. What's your favourite United season, says Rahul Krishna. Easy. 99. I don't normally agree with simming, but come on. We're playing so well at the moment. Why are we playing at 5.55? Yeah, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Right, this is a big game now. The reason I simmed that is to play this. Burnley. Burnley. Would you rather fight five lions or five men with knives? Says Callum21. Either way, I'm screwed. Either way, I'm screwed. I've only just joined. Have you mentioned Dortmund saying Sancho is likely to stay this summer and surely carrot cake is better than Victoria Sponge, says Sean Turner. Uh, I've not heard anything about this Dortmund thing. So, what's Anthony Martial want? When Anthony Martial talks, I listen. Liverpool have dropped points again. Look, 
13 games. They're five points behind. They've dropped points. Liverpool dropped points. Let's have a look too. We're leading the table with joint goal difference. Yes. Uh, Mark, do you own any Bitcoin or other crypto, says Nick P. I do. I, I can't remember what the name of the one I bought was. And Mark, have you been in a gay bar before, says Burnt Leno. Yes, I have. I'm, I'm, I, just You don't have to be gay to go in a gay bar. Like... They drew with Newcastle. Now now who's laughing? Now who's laughing? I lost to Newcastle on the opening day and everyone was like, oh, season over, you crap. Liverpool have just drawn to Newcastle at home. Nil-nil. It's all falling apart for them. It's all full part, falling apart for them. Who've Man City got? Bournemouth. You're going to do a preview for game next Saturday, says Andrew Chow. Not yet. It's a bit, be a bit early, a bit presumptions. One pair of shoes, rest of your life, what are they, says Murray. I'm not, I'm not really a shoe person, Murray, to be honest with you. Nice, nice, comfortable trainers, probably. Check who the highest scorers in the league are. Mbappe's got 11. Salah's got 12. Martial's got 9. Sterling's got 9. Deli Alli is overpowered on this game. He's crap. Away to Burnley as well. Oh, this is always a tough one. This is always tough, Burnley away. I don't like it. Well, how how do I change the ball? Because it's getting starting to get like it might snow. Where do you change the ball? There you go. No sliders. Look, legendary. There you go. Imagine if I played with that shit thing. No, I don't, I don't. I don't know what to do now. I don't know. I don't know what ball I had before. Random. Default. Swansea supplying United with the Welsh Beast. When's the next cooking with Goldbridge, says Jay Breezy Gaming. And thank you to Jamie Boy. The yellow ball looks quite bright. Well, I'm going to use it because I just don't know whether it's going to be snowing or not. Use the yellow one. Uh, has the lube come out yet, says Ben Benson. Not half. Up the difficulty. Get stuffed. Well, typical. It's just normal grass, look. Look at that. It's normal grass. It's a yellow ball on a pitch that's got really yellow sun on it. Great. Burnley are always a tough side anyway. Focus. Favourite ice cream? Mint. I do say some things with such conviction. Sean Dyche, masterclass. Sean Dick, as I call him. I don't pronounce the H. No, we're playing too good. What a ball. What a ball. Oh, terrible. Fuck it. Fuck it's at right back. Hey! What a t oh, come on, ref. you you got to book him for that if you're not going to give it. We're struggling to get to grips with this ball at the moment. <sighs> Typical. Why does history beckon for Kylian Mbappe? Catch. Burnley have started off well here. 
Fuck, it's a ledge on uh, my career mode. Here we go. Oh, poor fuck it. He can't keep up. Poor fuck it. Fuck it's going to have a very hard evening tonight. <laughs> that sounds like he's going to have a great time. I don't mean that. What's the point in playing? Ref's really soft here. Oh, he's giving us a free kick. Ref's doing a good job. Burnley doing what they always do. Pogba. That's a goal. Oh, come on, Bruno. You've got to be putting them in the top corner. Save again. Donnarumma's keeping us in this game at the moment. It's a cracking save, this. He should be scoring. That's a good save. That should be a goal when you're in that close in the box. Played well again today. And there's the goal. It's been totally deserved. Oh, my life. Something about Burnley. Simeone. Actually, Simeone's son. They always they always turn up against me, Burnley. I can't have another, I can't have another Burnley meltdown. I can't. I promised myself I wouldn't. Good goal. It's not played well. Fatigue. It's fatigue. Bruno, your running there was awful. Oh, that could have gone in. You sim, you lose. I simmed before this game. Very good point. Yes, you're right. Bloody hell. Oh, for God's sake. What's that all about? Never sim again, Mark, says Joshua. I've done it again, though, Joshua, haven't I? I've bloody done it. Idiot. Fuck it. He's clapping himself. He's such a big head fuck it as well. Heads the ball out and claps himself. What? We beat City. That's how the City game went. Pogba, come on.
What a ball. Go on. Fuck it, ain't catching you. Yes. Yes. Fuck it's fault. Exploited him again. Tonali with the ball over the top. And uh, I could have shot with Mbappe, but I had to make sure. 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, one. She's not happy. You see her? She was like that. Obviously a Burnley fan, but... I think there was a little bit of luck on the cut back there. I think it actually hit a Burnley player. No, maybe not. Is that a sweaty goal? Someone said that's sweaty. Is that is that when you make sure you're going to score with a little drag back or something? Yeah, but I never used to do that. And everyone says, oh, you should have done that. Good day from Australia, Mark. Big fan of United Stand. What a lightning squad you got there in Bappe Sancho. Why not play Rashford, says Veda. Where's Rashford going to play, though? I've got Sancho, Martial and Mbappe. This is set up now for the second half. Look at Tonali. He's, the, he is the, he's a big reason we're so good though. Sign Fockett. I wouldn't sign Fockett on this form. Oh, Jesus Christ. Right on half time. Burnley are back. Bloody Burnley again. Look at him. He's loving it. Batshuayi as well. That can't be the real Batshuayi. That can't be the crap Batshuayi from chat. Where's my bloody defence? Where's wan -Bissaka? Where's Varane? Can't believe it. What's the defence doing? I don't even know where the defence is there. Still, still celebrating the goal probably. We're back where we were. Corner. Give me the corner. Oh, ref! There's got to be a penalty in that. It's always bloody Burnley. Do you watch a lot of Italian football, says Sean Atwood? Sod off. You're being, you're being cheeky. We need to see the sliders for the CPU fullback, says Hakil Hall. Fine. Everyone loves Sean Dyche. It's like you turn the difficulty up for Burnley. Um, it's always bloody Burnley. I don't know what's going on. Oh, come on. Got to get back into this game fast. Oh. It's the yellow ball away. So you're right. It is the bloody yellow ball. going to be tough what's everyone on about 
Oh, 55's on injury frequency. Mine's on 55 for injury frequency as well. So the 55 that you're all talking about is injury frequency, which is on mine, which I'll show you at the end. It's, it's knocking up the injury frequency. Nothing else has been knocked up. What are you bloody on about? So people get obsessed about sliders on this. We've had it before. Come on, come on, come on. For fuck's sake, this is going to be a dropped point. This is going to be dropped. Oh, bloody hell. This is awful. Offside! He's given it! He's given the bloody goal! We're going to lose to Burnley. I can't believe we're going to lose to Burnley. Absolutely. Batch why he's, he's clearly onside. I can't believe it. Man City are laughing their heads off here. We've lost to Burnley. It's always Burnley. They get him a bloody head every time. Oh, for God's sake. How does he even stay onside there? Because he is. He's bloody onside, that's why. Oh, we've been awful today. Really bad. This is what happens every time I sim a game. Why do I do it? This, I can't even get angry. Why do I? Why do I sim games? Like the, every time I sim a game, we're always crap afterwards. Just don't sim a game. Absolutely, play. You know what? I'm really annoyed. Every time we play Burnley, they turn up like they're bloody Barcelona tossers. Always. And it's, 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 always, it's always on bloody FIFA as well. Oh, fucking God. I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. It's over. It's bloody over. I can't believe. I'm. I'm so so pissed off. They're like mid. They're not even that good. They're like. They're not even in the top half of the league, and they absolutely deserve to beat me. They really do deserve to win. I can't. Can't complain. It's just frustrating again. Wait. How can you beat Man City and Everton, and then go and play Burnley, who are crap, and lose? No angle. No angle to shoot. Burnley my bogey team. Bloody not much. Oh, come on. Fuck off. I can't even foul properly now. Look at this. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. How can you over it across like that?
It was going all so well. Too heavy of touch again. You see, against Everton, he takes that in his touch and he just taps it in the bottom corner. See, again, Dan James actually scored that chance against Everton. There's a lesson for you, everybody here. Don't sim games on career mode. It always bites you in the arse in the next game. Can't even get one back. Fucking hell. I mean, this is Burnley, by the way. Uh, they've been they've been absolutely brilliant. Burnley. Look at fuck it now. Well, we were taking the piss out of him in the first half. He's had a cracking game, and Burnley win three one. The crowd are going mad, says Sankello, and that is really poor. Really, really poor. It, you know what? It hurts my eyes. I can't even look at it. I hate Burnley. I bloody hate Burnley. I absolutely hate Burnley. I've been trying my best not to lose it in that game because I bloody well hate Burnley. Every FIFA. Man City are back at the top. Oh, what a, what a terrible, terrible thing. What a terrible, terrible, terrible thing. Just a moment of your time. You get you beat City, you go you go top of the league, you beat Everton 7-1, you sim a game, and then the very next game you're done over. I've got to be honest, Burnley with a better team. Thank you and Fock it, well, he's handed out the L's there. Bloody hell. Let's have a look. What we've got to come. Typical FIFA scripting, says Mike. I can beat Liverpool and Man City and then get hammered by the likes of Burnley, Crystal Palace and Norwich. You can't take any game for granted, that's for sure. Um, got a massive game coming up against Valencia uh, in the Champions League. Uh, we've got to go on a really good run here. We've got to go on a really good run ahead of Christmas. <sighs> Disappointing. Let's have a look at what Man City have got in their next few games. Oh, I just can't believe that. I'm gutted. Absolutely gutted. Man City have got Fulham. Easy games for Man City. That's bloody annoying, that is. Man City have lost one bloody game to us. Masterclass from Burnley, says Todd N. Look, I said they deserved it. They did. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Smash a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. We're back at 8 o'clock on the United Stand. And Cooking with Goldbridge will be going up tomorrow because I'm filming it tonight and eating it. So it definitely will go up tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Speak to you all soon.